This is for Leo, Summer Rising, and Venus signs. For Leo, Summer Rising, and Venus signs. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and also comment. I do appreciate all my Leos out here. For my cross watches, this energy can't be resonated. So just be a little aware that as you're tuning in, we do got somebody from the past that has something they want to say to Leo right now. I couldn't let you get close to me. It might be an air sign. I regret lying to you. So this person did lie to you. This could be another fire sign for some of you as well. I knew exactly what I was doing. So for a lot of you that's wondering if this person meant to do what they did, they did, Leo. Just being near you is intoxicating. My life is not together as it seems. This person likes to put on a facade. Libra, Aries, maybe. Virgo, I know I messed up everything. This person knows they fucked up with you, Leo. They know they fucked up bad. I don't react when people mention you. I know I'll cross that line with you. I wish I could share my good news with you. This person found out something recently, possibly today. I'm afraid to contact you. I hide behind material things. I look for you everywhere. This person looks for your traits in other people, in other men or other women. I do appreciate all my Leos out here. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Also, comment. I am still doing five for five questions for Leo. You can email me right now. Quick email reading for 10. You can call me right now for 30. The cash app is D E E F O N D E L. The email is there, fondillagmail.com. You can check out the description below for more. Of course, there is a link there for you to book me as well. We got some Aries energy here. We got, it's time to take action. We got some Pisces energy. We got meditate and contemplate. Somebody's dealing with an Aries or a Pisces. We got be bold and make the first move. Somebody could be coming in for Leo. This could be somebody coming in towards you. You could be wanting to go towards someone. This could be a Capricorn for some of you. We got the end to a tough cycle approaches. So for a lot of my Leos, this is something coming to an end that just keeps repeating itself. Whether this is a toxic relationship, whether this is a job, whether this is an issue, you know, with family, your kids, whatever it is. We got step outside your comfort zone. So for a lot of my Leos, this is going to require you to do something that you might not be the most comfortable with, but it's going to help you in the long run. This could be with a Pisces. We got balanced spirituality and practicality. I'm getting that's really important for a lot of you. This could be with a Gemini for some of you. We got communication is the key. For a lot of you, that's the only way this situation is actually going to work. It's not going to be successful without communication for a lot of you. We got some Leo energy here. We got creative intimacy. So for a lot of you, you could be spicing things up in the bedroom a little bit, trying something new. Some of you even considering like poly. I'm getting a lot of different situations here. You know, take what energy resonates and leave what does it for somebody else. We got some Gemini energy here and some Taurus. A lot of Taurus energy. We got secrets and discoveries. Okay, so you're going to be doing a little bit of research, digging up a little bit of tea, you know, maybe asking around and you're going to find out some things. This could be the other way around. So somebody could be finding out some things about you. You know, we got some Libra energy here. We got protect your feelings. So for a lot of you, that's definitely the message. Especially for those of you dealing with somebody. If this is a Taurus or a Libra, we got the hate nurtured with love. Somebody portrays that they love you, but it's like they secretly hate you. And they're planning to stab you in the back. Somebody could be 35. This could be a Virgo. Somebody could be 24. This could be a Libra for a lot of you. We got created a new self. Somebody could be 25. So for a lot of you, I'm seeing you rebrand yourself. I'm seeing you show yourself in a different light. A lot of people are going to look at Leo and this high priestess energy because they're seeing that Leo's not tolerating much. Leo's not playing any games anymore. We got the lover's card. We got love coming in for Leo. Somebody could be 21. Somebody could have a 15 year old. Somebody could be 22. We got some Pisces energy. We got meditation. So for a lot of you, this is going to require meditation. Somebody could be 27. I'm seeing a lot of my Leos rising above a lot of bullshit. A lot of stuff that really doesn't serve them. We got communication. Okay, so for a lot of you, this could be communicating. Somebody could have a 10 year old. Maybe you could have a 20. You could be 20. We got love and spirit. So for a lot of my Leos, you have somebody watching you right now. This is a family member. 
This could be a friend. This is somebody that really loves you, really caring about you, watching you right now. For a lot of you that invested into something recently, this is going to pay out for you. Somebody could be 29 for my Leos that did invest into something. Somebody could be 23. We do got the mirror card. So right now, for a lot of my Leos, this is the time to have a self-reflection moment and look back at yourself. I do appreciate all my Leos. Thank you.